Early in the century, the earthquake at a place X registered 8.3 on the Richter scale. In the same year, another earthquake was recorded at another place Y, which was four times stronger. What was the magnitude of the earthquake in Y? Magnitude is 8.9. Welcome to Amit's Math School. In this video, I am going to discuss about Richter scale and the use of logarithm. That is, how logarithm is used in Richter scale to find the magnitude of an earthquake. Charles Richter defined the magnitude of an earthquake to be r equal log 10 base i divided by s, where i is the intensity of the earthquake and s is the intensity of a standard earthquake. That is smallest detectable. So the magnitude of a standard earthquake, which is r equal log 10 base i divided by s, since i is the intensity of the earthquake, which will be equal to s in case of an a standard earthquake, that is smallest detectable earthquake. So we can write r equal log 10 base s divided by s, which is log 10 base 1, which is 0. So the intensity of the standard earthquake is zero that is the magnitude of an standard earthquake that is smallest detectable earthquake which is zero now each number of increase in the richter scale indicate an intensity 10 times stronger how that is 10 base logarithm is used to calculate the magnitude of an earthquake so r1 which is equal to log 10 base 10 s divided by s in this case the earthquake is 10 times the standard earthquake which is equal to log 10 base 10 which is equal to 1 now r2 that is log 10 base 100 s divided by s that is 10 times this earthquake that is 100 s which is equal to log 10 base 100 which is equal to 2 that is each number increase on the richter scale indicate an intensity 10 times stronger that is in this case 1 and in this case 2, that is one number in case here in the Richter scale. So, the value, that is the intensity is 10 times stronger, that is 10s, in this case 100s, 10 times stronger. So, each number increase on the Richter scale indicate an intensity 10 times stronger. The intensity of an earthquake was recorded which was 30 times stronger than the standard earthquake. What was the magnitude of that earthquake? The solution that is according to the formula r equal to log 10 base i divided by s. Here i equal to 30 times s that is 30 times stronger than the standard earthquake. So r equal to log 10 base 30 s by s which is log 10 base 30 which is equal to 1.48 approximate to 1.5. In this case, the magnitude of the earthquake was 1.5. That is, if the intensity of an earthquake is recorded that is 30 times stronger than the standard earthquake, in that case, the value in the Richter scale will be 1.5. Early in the century, the earthquake at a place X registered 8.3 on the Richter scale. In the same year, another earthquake was recorded at another place Y, which was four times stronger. What was the magnitude of the earthquake in Y? There is, according to formula, we can write 8.3, which is equal to log 10 base Ix divided by S. Here, Ix is the intensity of the earthquake at the place X, and S is the standard earthquake. And for the Y, we can write Ry is equal to log 10 base 4 Ix divided by S, because the earthquake at plus y is 4 times stronger than this ix, that is 4 ix divided by s. And here we can write according to the logarithm formula log 10 base ix minus log 10 base s. And here we can write log 10 base 4 ix minus log 10 base s. And here we can apply the logarithm formula also, that is log 10 base 4 plus log 10 base ix minus log 10 base s. And here, this part is similar to this one. So, it, we can substitute the value here, that is Ry equal to log 10 base 4 plus 8.3. The value of log 10 base 4, which is 0 0.60 and plus 8.3, which is 8.9. So, the magnitude of the earthquake in Y, that is 8.9. That is in Richter scale, 
magnitude is 8.9. A recent earthquake measure 7.1 on the Richter scale. How many times more intense was that quick described in the place x that is in the in the previous problem the solution in this case that is according to formula we can write from the previous case that is 8.3 equal to log 10 base i x divided by s just like previous one that is 8.3 equal to log 10 base i x minus log 10 base s and we can find log 10 base s which is equal to log 10 base i x minus 8.3 now for the recent earthquake that is 7.1 which is equal to log 10 base i n divided by s in this case this i n is the intensity of the recent earthquake and this one is the previous case that is which was measured 8.3 now we can write 7.1 equal to log 10 base i n minus log 10 base s or log 10 base s which is equal to log 10 base i n minus 7.1 and here we, ha we are going to find the ratio of ix and in that is how many times intense was the earthquake described in the place x from these two equation we can write the left hand side are equal so the right hand side will be equal that is log 10 base in minus 7.1 which is equal to log 10 base ix minus 8.3 so after simplification that is we can write log 10 base ix divided by in which is equal to 1.2 ix divided by in which is equal 10 to the power 1.2 which is approximate to 16. So, so 16 times is our result. That is, 16 times more intense was the earthquake described in the place X. If the magnitude of an earthquake is 7.1 and another one is 8.3, this 8.3 measured earthquake was 16 times intense than this 7.1.